Hey everybody, welcome back to the Coin Pusher. Today the manager come up to us wanting us to pay one billion dollars for this game. He was going to offer us a thousand quarters for a billion dollars. I told him no, no way, I am not doing that. We ended up talking him down to a fifty million dollar buy-in with fifty quarters. We've just about got all fifty of them in there. In fact, right there was the last of them. I think we made the right choice. We'll see how it goes, though. Oh, wow. Yeah, we pulled quite a bit of quarters out of there already. Let's keep her going. Hopefully we can clear this whole machine out on a $50 million buy-in. That's a lot better than a billion. Goodness. We just got a green earbud. So that'll cover the price of the uh, red shelves. The red shelves cost twice the buy-in. So... If we hadn't got that reduced price, we would have ended up paying two billion dollars. But luckily, it's only a hundred million. But with that green earbud, it's absolutely free. Uh, there's that peach earbud over there on that right side. I guess it's a free tower made out of ten thousand dollar chips. If we can get that, that would be pretty sweet. We just got a white one. Oh, nice! We just got the peach one as well. The white one it gets us a free tower made out of twenty five thousand dollar chips. So far, this game is doing extremely well. Oh, nice. We're turning down that wall. There was a massive wall. Oh, oh, oh. oh my goodness. This is doing amazingly. We're pulling that uh, mystery bag off the red shelf, it looks like. That's pretty nice. Some good news. It'll get us a little bit of an insight into what's, what's in the mystery bags. We can get it to go into the pay. All kinds of $10,000 tips going right into the pay as we speak. Pushing really well. That humongous tower on the pusher, the one that's going forward and backwards. That thing is made out of $5,000 and $25,000 chips alternating throughout. And we're ripping a $25,000 chip right out of the base of that big old tower as we speak. There it went. Get a couple more of those out of there and it'll probably topple over. I can hope anyways. Getting all kinds of gold bars and ten thousand dollar chips in the meantime, as well as quarters. We got a whole bunch of quarters now, so we're doing pretty good on that. Oh, nice! That mystery bag just moved some more. Oh yeah, I think we're gonna get it. I'm pretty confident we're gonna get that big old mystery bag. Yeah, I don't like to pay a, a billion dollars for no game anymore. It's just it's just too expensive. Too risky. It's too much on the line. Yeah, with a thousand quarters, you can do a lot, you know, but it can turn bad pretty quick. A thousand quarters in the wrong spot can turn pretty sour. Of course, I probably wouldn't have made it go sour. You know, I would have been really careful and made sure they went in the right place. But you just never know. There's no guarantees on any of this. So. I felt like a $50 million was uh, as much as I was willing to risk. I'm hoping we made the right decision. If we're super duper lucky, uh, I didn't get to see the game. Like There was a transition period where they might have came in here and changed it up took out some of the uh, stuff in the mystery bags or whatnot. So there might be less in here than what there would have been if it had been a billion dollar game. Or maybe if they left the same amount of stuff in there. It, it's difficult to say. There was about a half an hour between uh, our negotiation and when I actually got to play. I guess we'll find out. Well, we, I guess we'll never really will find out. If we're lucky, we'll win like $3 billion or something. That would be really nice. And I'm going to guess if they uh, adjusted for the price, then we'll get nowhere near that amount. So it'd be pretty nice to get at least a billion or more. But I wouldn't count on it. They probably adjusted it for uh, um, 
since we did a lower buy-in. Maybe not. Oh my gosh. A huge tower. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's, it's clogged up the loot here. We gotta get it unclogged. Goodness, I hope we get a 1025 chip. I think a whole bunch of that went right on into the, uh, fell inside the machine. If you let it overflow like that, it'll back up and things will fall inside the machine. Places where we don't get none of it. Unless we get a 1025 chip, of course. Then they, they clear everything out. There's secret compartments. You see, oh, you can't see it. There's a hole right here and there's a hole right there. And there's another one down inside of the, inside of the pay area. But anyways, the stuff that falls in those certain areas goes somewhere completely different. Little secret compartments. We don't get none of that unless we get the 1025 chip. It's just a basic chip. It says $10 on one side and $25 on the other side. But uh, they're extremely rare. We don't get them very often. But I just thought I'd bring it up in case uh, we do win one. Now we all know what it is. That mystery bag is moving on up real well. Speaking of that moving on up, it just went into the pay. Nice. Hasn't, uh, it's kind of stuck in there. There you go, you can see it now, I think. It's, it's stuck right down there. Well, you can kind of see where it, there's a spot way over that way. And when it gets up to that amount full, then stuff goes back inside the machine. Which I don't think that should be fair. They shouldn't be allowed to do that, but they do. They get by with it. It's my responsibility, I guess, to make sure it doesn't overflow like that. I try to keep a really good eye on it. There was just so much that fell all at once right there. There was not much I could do about it. Hopefully. We'll get a 1025 chip. If not, we'll... We'll try to play a second game right after this one. Maybe if we play back-to-back -back games, we'll get lucky and I'll get 1025 chip. They are pretty rare though. We may have to play a couple of games. We'll see how it goes. Nice, we got it. Let's check it out, see what's in there. Oh my gosh, look at that. Yeah, they did not adjust this for the for the reduced buy-in price, did they? Oh my goodness, look at all those dice. Let's see, one, two, nine of the white dice, three of the golden dice. And I bet you this is the 1025. Indeed it is. Oh my goodness, that's so that's what I was talking about. It says $10 on one side and $25 on the other. That gets us everything that fell down in that hole, that hole, and a little slit that's down there somewhere. I'm not sure if the camera can see it or not. I can't hardly really see it. But anyway, that is absolutely amazing. I say all we got left is one $5,000 chip. Might as well go ahead and turn in the green earbud, have them take all this stuff off the red shelves, because there's a bunch of it. Put it all in the playing field, and then we'll get right back to pushing. Alrighty, we're back, we paid. We paid the insurance as well as turning in that green earbud. So we got everything off the red shelves, and then if we lose anything to the red shelves, uh, we potentially can get it back. It will have a $10,000 deductible, though. But we do have, um, what is it, a white earbud? Yeah, a white earbud and a peach earbud. We can turn them in. They'll get us a free reset, as well as a uh, uh, corresponding free tower that comes with them. So that's pretty amazing. And we got the 1025 chip. So we got three free resets headed our way. So maybe we shouldn't have bothered with the insurance today. It's just so so risky not to pay though. It's, it's such an affordable price for what it can cover. I don't know, I think I, real, I made the right decision. It's 100 grand up front, and 10 grand every time you use it. We'll see. I guess we'll find out together. A humongous tower is about to go. Timber! 
Wow, that pushed the uh, mystery bag right on into the pack. Goodness, that was quick. Oh yeah, tear it down, buddy. Tear it down, coin pusher. Knock it all down, push it into the pay. That is a lot of $10,000 chips. Quite a few gold bars. Going for a humongous pay today. Oh yeah, pushing super good. Got two towers standing. I think that's the same two that was standing earlier. I'm thinking maybe there was uh, more than that standing down there in that lower area. But I think it was just, I was overwhelmed with how big that tower was. That was on the pusher. Yeah, I think the, oh, maybe the mystery bag. Maybe that's what I'm thinking about. Yep, either way, it's doing fantastic. We got the one on the right to fall over. We lost a little bit of it to the red shelves. But like I said, we got a couple of free resets headed our way. Oh yeah, look at it go. It's doing good. Wow, that was a humongous push. Indeed it was. A mighty fine push. quarters already. Let me grab some more. All right, let's check it out. See what's in this here mystery bag. Oh my gosh, look at that. Wow. Nine of the white dice and four of the golden dice. That is absolutely incredible. Oh my gosh. This is going to be a, hopefully a multi-billion dollar win. Wow. Good data. I'm glad we ended up buying it in on this game. Goodness. Couldn't imagine passing this up. Oh my. It's gonna be a good one. Nice. It's got 50 grand. It's all over there on that left corner. I think we'll keep pushing across the whole field though. Go for a nice even push. Maybe put a little bit extra on the left. Still keep a little going on that right side. Keep a nice even flow. Seems to be working. Oh yeah, nice. I'm not even sure how much that was. 70, 80,000. Maybe more. Oh yeah, it's moving on up. about 40 grand hanging over the edge. Hopefully we can get it. Oh yeah, we got it. We got that 40 grand. I think it was 40 anyways. It might have been 30. Wow, it's 
The rest of it's moving on up now. Making away. Oh yeah. Keep her pushing. Nice, they went 10 grand. Just about got it completely out of there. Ten grand to go. Let's get it. And, uh, well, let's work on getting a couple of these quarters back also. Let's see. We should turn in, what, the white ear, bud? Get our free tower made out of $25,000 chips. That hopefully will be a massive tower. We'll see. We will definitely see here very, very soon. Oh, nice. We got her completely cleared out. Alrighty. Be right back. We turned in that white earbud. Got our free tower. That's that one right in there in the center. And uh, they started to walk away and I was like, well, that's kind of kind of puny. Um, you want to go ahead and, and go ahead and just let me turn in the, the peach earbud also. And then I'll just get my two free resets just like normal. Which we done used one of them, obviously, when we turned into the, the uh, white earbud. But we do have one extra reset since we turned them both in at the same time. So, plus we got the 1025 chip, which gets us a free reset. But anyways, we're playing the... Uh, we turned in the white earbud and the peach earbud. That's what, I'm, that's what I'm trying to get at. It just didn't come out correctly, I guess. Pushing good though. That's quite a bit when you add it all together. All the twenty-five and the ten thousand dollar chips. Quite a bit indeed. And we got the ten twenty-five chip. It's hard to say how much is in that man. Hopefully a whole bunch. We're doing super duper good. We haven't pulled no fifty million dollars, obviously, but the dumb multipliers. Hopefully we can get way above 50 million. So if you happen to be new to the channel, the white dice, they multiply the, the old poker chips you're seeing in there. And them golden dice, they multiply the golden bars. Later on we'll roll them. And uh, whatever numbers are facing up will be what our multipliers are. Now there's not technically numbers on the dice. They're just little dots. But uh, if it's facing up with a two on it, like two dots are facing up, then that would be a two. And if there's four dots that you can see on the on the top, then that's a four. It goes from one to six. And we don't win anything on ones. It's gotta be two or above. So hopefully we can pull some really nice numbers out of there. And uh, go home a billionaire. That's the goal. Hoping we can do it. We played a game earlier today. And we lost. Oh, not as much as it could have been, but we paid a hundred million dollars for a hundred quarters. And it played through pretty well. But when we rolled the dice, we didn't do so great. We ended up pulling, I think it was about 87 million. So we lost like 13 million dollars on that game. Hopefully we can at least make that back, the 13 million plus the 50. So we need to make 50, 50, sorry, 63 million dollars. Of course we had the insurance on the other game also. So 60 million, 63 million and 200,000. We can pull that out of here. That would be really fantastic. I would really, really like that. I think we can do it. I'm hoping we can. I was kind of devastated that we lost 13 million. It was just all in the right, in the wrong spot for them dice. 
They just didn't do as well as they should have. If there was what? Two? Two white dice and one golden dice? If I remember right. Which is way, way too less of the amount. Should have been more than that for a hundred million dollar game. That's why I say you gotta be careful with these games. You can't put all your eggs in one basket. They will get you. Get you indeed. So, you know, a normal person, that would have took them out. They'd be done for. Luckily, we we have a bunch in our reserve just in case. But it is dwindling on the way, you know, if they keep on getting us like they've been doing the last couple of days. Well, I guess it's been going on a couple of months now. We try to show the best of the best, so we're not going to dwell on the past and the losses and all that. Just saying, it's, it's there. It happens. Let's get that on the right side right there. Then we'll turn in that 1025 chip. Hopefully, like I said, there'll be a whole bunch in that in there. Go home a billionaire today. Come on. Oh, nice. We got her all cleared out. Sweet. All right. Well, we'll be right back. We turned in that 1025 chip, and oh boy, did they load this puppy up good. Wow, this is a lot of stuff. They got a humongous tower back there. I don't know what you would call that. A Christmas tree, maybe a birthday cake. I couldn't tell you. A wedding cake, maybe? Yeah, probably a wedding cake. It's like a lot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven layer cake, I guess. I know, I'm not real familiar with how they make cakes. Either way, it's doing fabulous. We're pushing it on over pretty good. It's already got some of it pushed in. Oh, nice. Look at that. Oh, it was hollow in the center, wasn't it? Wasn't a continuous bake through cake. I don't know. Maybe real fluffy, huh? Got a big guy on it. Fluffed up. Is that what dough does? It rises when it rises. Makes air pockets. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm, I never cooked a cake in my entire life. Couldn't tell you. Oh, timber! Making an absolute fortune though. There's a $25,000 chip over there on that right side. So I figured I'd let everybody know that that $1,000 chip that was in there is not a special chip. It's just a $1,000 chip that's not $500 on the other side. In case you've seen it, I didn't even notice it. Uh, let's check out the mystery bag though. Let's see what's in there. Ah, oh, sweet. Two more of the white dice. Oh my gosh, this is going to be a big win for sure. Wow. Oh wow, that tire on the left is moving. Oh yeah, we're getting some $25,000 chips over there on the right. Nice. Got a $50,000 push. Load it up real nice and thick like. Oh, you know what? Instead of doing that, oh look at that, I dropped a $25,000 chip in the machine. It's gonna say instead of doing that, we should just do one of our free resets. Cause we got a free reset headed our way. Have them move all that stuff and take that uh, 
$25,000 ship off for the red shell. Ooh, I don't know though. If we do that, and then uh, one of them towers end up falling on the red shelves, then we'll be out of free resets, won't we? Yeah, we will. We'll be out of free resets at that point. So then we'd have to use our insurance. That would cost us 10 grand. We'll see how it goes. Let's at least try to get some of these quarters back. We've got way too many quarters in there. Maybe we'll get lucky and then knock them towers over. We'll see. Indeed we will. All right, well that was the last of the quarters. I think it'd be a good idea to go ahead and uh, uh, get our free reset, have them move all that stuff, and then we'll get right back to pushing. All righty, I'm back. We uh, told them we wanted our free reset because we turned in, um, what was it? What colors were they? White and peach earbud at the same time. So we had an extra free reset. So we went ahead and turned it in this that's what we come back to they took the stuff that was on the corners and that um, I'm not even sure what it, I think it was a twenty five thousand dollar chip if I remember right it was on the red shelf and they built this thing right here in the center which is a good deal I'm glad they built it in the center and not not one of the edges that would have been rough but we still potentially it could fly over there and land on them red shelves we're gonna hope it don't I'm trying to push nice and even doesn't do that. Sometimes it's just out of our control. Oh my, we need to put a little bit extra on the left, I think. Get that left side to catch up with the right. Ooh. All right. So far, so good. We're going to have to keep the quarters kind of light in there, though. Otherwise, ooh, nice. That works. Uh, they potentially could raise those chips up above the the push way up there and then they'll fall over onto the, the red shelves. We've seen it happen before. We definitely don't want it to happen today. Don't want to pay no 10 grand for that. Something we can we totally can control. Doing good. Nothing's even really getting close to them gutters, which is amazing. All pushing nice and straight. Now there is a $5,000 chip on the right side. It, it might want to go in the gutter, and if it does, I guess it does. It's, you know, technically all this stuff fell up, fell in the gutter at one point. That's why we're playing it. So that's what this stuff is. Well, some of it might have been from the overflow too that I I didn't catch in time. It probably got who knows how much from us. Significant amount probably. Luckily, we had that 1025 chip, so we were able to get it all back and get at least a second chance at winning it all. I'm feeling pretty good about it. I think we're going to pull out with a really good profit today. We are going to lose that five grand, it looks like. Which is the gutter on the right side. It's all right. It'll be in there for the next person. Could be us. Who knows? It's in there now, though. We are out of quarters. Let me grab some more quarters real quick. Pushing good. Pushing real good. 
Yeah, baby. Nice. Moving on out. Oh, that's a beautiful push right there. Nice. Oh yeah, it's all on the edge. Sweet, that's a huge push. What do we need? 125 grand? Let's get it. Oh my goodness, we almost got it all the same push. Got 100 of it. $25,000 to go, and then we'll roll them dice. And we got a bunch of dice. Oh, sweet, there it is. We got her completely cleared out. All right, let me call them back here and have them put them dice in there. All righty. Let's push these dice on down to that lower shelf. Uh, I loaded it up as good as I could because I figured with that many dice, there's a potential we couldn't end up pushing them all the way into the pay if we ain't careful. So we loaded it up super nice. Hopefully they're all just kind of stacked right there at the end of the thing. Getting some pretty good numbers in there. Remember, they gotta be two or better to count. See how it goes. A lot of fours I'm seeing, and some six, fives. Ooh, see if this push right here will get it all out of there. Come on. Ooh, no, we didn't. All right, let's go for another push. Come on, come on. There it is. Oh, nice. At a five, it will stay. Oh, and a six over there. I think that three turned over to a one. But uh, let me uh, tally it all together. We'll multiply it by that right there. And we'll be right back. All right, so all together we pulled $22,426,000 out of there. And them white dies totaled it up to 75, turned it into an astounding $1,680,000. Nine hundred and fifty thousand dollars. That is absolutely incredible. We also pulled 84 ounces of gold out of there and them golden dice totaled up to 23. Turned it into 1,932 ounces of gold. All in all, that is not bad for a 50 million and $100,000 buy-in. Not bad at all. Well, I hope you all enjoy the videos. Do me a favor, hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed. And we'll see you on the next one. Y'all take care.